Neuraltone AI is your virtual colorist assistant built out of eight neural network trained AI models designed specifically to produce cinematic color grades. For every image processed through Neuraltone AI, Film AI will offer eight color grading suggestions based on the context of your image. You can use Neuraltone AI suggestions as is or as a starting point for your grade. Unlike presets or ready-made looks, which use the same set of changes at all times, Neuraltone AI analyzes your image and grades it much like a human colorist would. Every Neuraltone AI model has its own unique style and preference, so you'll most likely find a few grades that fit your creative direction, whatever that might be. To use Neuraltone AI, you must be on the pro plan of Film AI. Neuraltone AI can be added to your images as a tool, or it can be invoked from the contextual menu under the Media tab on the right-hand side of the app. As these two options differ slightly in their functionality, we'll cover them both. To add Neuraltone AI as a tool to your image, simply click on the Neuraltone AI option in the Controls tab on the left-hand side of the app. Please note, controls in Film AI are unavailable until you have loaded an image and selected the appropriate input and output transforms, so make sure to do that before trying to use the Neuraltone AI tool. Immediately after adding the tool, Neuraltone AI will begin analyzing your image and will offer its suggestions as thumbnails as soon as the analysis is complete. You can manually resize the thumbnail column for a better preview, and you can also collapse the previous column once you have selected a look for unobstructed view of your image. Once the analysis is complete and Neuraltone AI has created the color grading suggestions, these suggestions are saved in the app so that they are instantly available next time you load the image. If you save a Neuraltone AI grade as a candidate and use that candidate to copy the grade over to another image, the very same grade will be copied over without further analysis of the second image. If you wish to analyze the second image and have Neuraltone AI create new grades based on the context of that image, please click on the Regenerate button in the Neuraltone AI tool. If you change the position of the Neuraltone AI tool in relation to the other tools, Film AI will not recalculate the results in the new position. To recalculate the results in the new position, click on the Regenerate button. You can change various parameters within the Neuraltone AI tool for more flexibility and faster workflow. If you change any of the parameters, the thumbnails preview for all Neuraltone AI generated grades are updated and the new settings are applied to all looks. Now, let's see how we can use the Neuraltone AI tool from within the contextual menu in the Media tab on the right-hand side of the app. To use the Neuraltone AI, click on the three dots next to your asset, select Neuraltone AI option, and pick the AI model you wish to use for processing your image. Your image will be processed using the pre-selected AI model, however, Neuraltone AI will still calculate the rest of the results should you wish to use any one of them at a later stage. Typically, you would use this option once you've established that you like a particular AI model and you want to batch process multiple assets using that specific model. To batch process multiple assets, select the first asset in the list, then click and hold the Shift key on your keyboard and click on the last asset in the list that you wish to process. With several assets now selected, click on the three dots next to any one of the selected assets and use the Neuraltone AI option. Film AI will batch process all of the selected assets using the chosen AI model. From here, it's advisable to use the compare view to see how your newly created grades look like. With multiple assets still selected, click on the three dots next to any one of the selected assets and select compare view. This will allow you to evaluate your color grades. If you're happy with the results, we suggest saving your newly created grades as candidates. This will make sure your grades are safely stored. However, you don't have to do it manually for every graded asset. Instead, with multiple assets still selected, click on the contextual menu next to any one of the selected assets and select the Save as a Candidate option. This will batch save all your grades as candidates. At this point, you might want to export your grades as LUTs, XMP profiles, or Capture One styles. If you're a still photographer, you will probably want to save a high-resolution version of your graded images. Now that we have covered the basics of using Neuraltone AI, let's see a slightly different approach to how we can use Neuraltone AI to establish the look for our shoot. I'll begin by using the Neuraltone AI to establish the base for my grade. Then, I'll combine this look with the Color Film Boost Pro 10 LUT, 
which I like for its color density, saturation, and highlight roll-off. Finally, I'll set a warmer white point for my image using the Illuminant option. Next, I'll save my grade as a candidate. With my grade saved, I'll use it to copy the grade over to other images in my project. Two of the images are clearly warmer and when the grade is copied over, they look way too warm. However, since I like my base look, I will not recalculate the Neural Tone AI results for these two images and instead, I'll simply change the white balance. This will maintain my original grade characteristics using the new white balance value. From here, I can either save my images or export my newly created grades as LUTs, XMP profiles, or Capture One styles. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please check out our YouTube channel to learn more about Film AI. Until next time, keep creating cool stuff.